This looks like the exact hospital from when I was trapped in the birth to death of Hunger Games program. Because this is the hospital it was based off of and there has to be a clue here as to who is doing this to well, us. It's gonna be pretty hard to get a clue when you guys are so loud. We're supposed to be sneaking in. Okay. Rebecca, what's up with the pink sparkly shoes? Um, they were a gift and I like them. Uh, from Amanda. So what? They're cute. Okay, let's just find this clue and get out of here. Hold on, these weren't in the program when I was in the hospital. What are these? They look like costumes. Scoob? Cop outfit? This kind of looks like Midnight Storm from no Among way. Us. Is that Piggy? What are these doing in a hospital? I do not know. Someone's coming. Get back at them. You guys, that's Mick. Why is he in a doctor's outfit? What is the mechanic doing at a hospital? I'm at the hospital pretending to be a doctor. I have my credentials. What's up, Amanda? Why is he pretending to be a doctor? And of course he's on the phone with Amanda. Shh. Quiet. So you gave Isaac a cookie during the GMN challenge last Monday, but it isn't working as permanently. Looks like he's becoming immune to the hypnosis. Game Master Spice, a ton of you have been commenting that Amanda's cookies are what's hypnotizing Isaac to do whatever she wants. I knew that he didn't actually like her. What cookies are you guys talking about? The red ones. No, we don't have the black reactivator. Using the black reactivator and eating the cookies is the only way for the hypnosis to be permanent. You better get your hands on that black reactivator. They need the black reactivator to make the hypnosis permanent. Well, we have the black reactivator. And we are not letting them get it. What do you mean Rebecca's at the hospital? How do you know that? How does she know I'm here? Hey, we need to get out of here. You guys get out of here, I'm staying here. What, what are you crazy? He has a little more explaining to do. I got this, go. What, Matt, be careful. I'm never careful. Well, I have to find her. Matt better not be using one of those disguises. <laughs> We need to figure out the ingredients in Amanda's cookie recipe so we can find out how she's hypnotizing Isaac. Okay, well right now we need to get out of here so Amanda doesn't know hey that guys. we're- Hey, Amanda! What are you doing here? What are you doing oh, here? I just happened to be in the area. We were just kind of killing time because there's a challenge going on at our warehouse. Me versus grandma cooking challenge. But Maddie and I can't be a part of it because we're really bad at baking. Hey, actually I'm really good at baking. Wait, she's I'm a good baker. They are looking for a third, but you can win $10,000. $10,000? No, but I'll do it. What do I need? They just need you to bring your cookbook. Okay, that's okay. what it's called. I'm not, see, that's why I'm, we're bad at baking. Okay, I got it. I will let them know. They'll be super excited to have a third. I'm gonna go run and get my cookbook. I'll be right there. Okay. Bye! Sorry we won't see you, because obviously, you know, we can't bake. You didn't tell you have a challenge for $10,000? Maddie! There is no challenge. What? We are going to be the grandma, so we can get the cookbook. What if Amanda wins? Well, that's not gonna happen, but if it does, we'll split it. Five and five. Five K, five K. I don't have that kind of money. Don't worry. All we have to do is get that cookbook, okay? And you can bake, right? You just said yeah, you can. Kind of. All right, Grandma. Well, we'll see if that is actually true. Hey, Game Master Spies. I am Marge. And I am Gertrude. And we're gonna get that cookie recipe from Amanda in her cookbook. Wait, Amanda's not here yet. You don't have to talk like I'm that. I'm practicing, okay? Do you even have your cookbook? Yes, I have it right here. Do you have yours? Yeah, of course I do. Can I see it? Uh -huh. I'm so excited to be here. I'm Amanda. So nice to meet you. Come right on in, young lady. Oh, yeah. I'm so excited for this grandma and me cooking challenge. Yes, now, if you win, you get $10,000, but if you lose, you have to give up your cookbook. That's why I'm gonna win. Gertrude, <laughs> what? what unique cookbook you have there? Where did you get that from? Oh, I got it from a room up there. Is that oh. tape? <laughs> it is my cookbook of recipes, very delicate. Page 46 is a really delicious recipe. You better hope you don't lose then. Well, let's get going on this me versus grandma cooking challenge. Hey, whoa. Can I see your doctor's credentials? Uh, uh, I left them in my... That's I, what I thought. I, I have some questions for you. Over here. Oh, oh, oh. Get over here. Oh, you know what? Get over here. Oh, no. I, Okay. I'm on to you. I'm gonna ask you some questions. Unless you want to be fingerprinted and booked downtown. No fingerprints. I have patience I have to get to. Are you working with Amanda? Yes. We're building a level of trust right now. I need to know that I can trust you. You can trust me. Unless, you know what? I can just do your fingerprints right now. Wait, what? No, uh, no. Okay. That's, okay. I was playing video games. That's why my fingerprints are all screwed up. Fingerprints never lie. Round one of the me versus grandma cooking challenge is Ras Krispie Tree. You know, a lot of my recipes, I don't really keep in my book. I just keep them right here in my noggin. Now this a great memory. Yeah, nothing's butter than butter. I don't think that's a saying, but okay. And I mix it on up. Back in my day, I used to win all the competition. Oh, like, what do you cook? I cook like anything that can go in a microwave, really. There's this Me thing too. called a TV to 
in all. And I really like that. Like from the store? Yes, and a postmark. It's my specialty. You mean postman? No, it's a postmark. I said it's a recipe. Oh. Well, young oh. lady, oh. do you have any special recipes you like to make? I love making cookies and a bunch of like other baked goods. Who do you make them for? Oh, my boyfriend. Boyfriend, tell me more. He just loves these cookies I make him, and I'm sure he'll love these too. It's a little gooier than I remember. Wow, they're Gertrude, remember? That one of these grandmas needs to actually win. It can't just all be on one of them shoulders. What are you talking about? Both need to have a good chance of winning and not mess up their recipe. Oh, uh, it's that time. I ate a lot of prunes this morning. I gotta use the bathroom, but I'll be back. Mar, just make it good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Count on Mars to make it good. Young lady, do you have that recipe for your oh, cookies in this Oh, it's very cookie? top secret. Please, yes, it's in my own special recipe. When I'm an old lady, you can tell me everything. It's like we're best friends. Well, it's a very secret family recipe, so. Telling someone's not gonna hurt no one. <gasps> the main mission of this is to get the cookbook from Amanda so we can find out that cookie recipe. And I cannot bake. I put all of the butter in there. I had no idea, but you know what? I came prepared. I knew we were doing Rice Krispie treats, so guess what? If you can't beat them, buy them and pretend you baked them. Do you know what Amanda puts in those delicious cookies she makes? I don't know what she puts in the cookies. Do you know what those cookies do? Whoever eats the cookies gets hypnotized and they will do whatever she says. Interesting. Oh, I hate clicking noises! <laughs> oh, no, no. The only way you're gonna get it is if you win, which is gonna be really hard for you. And you said you make those sugar cookies for your boyfriend? I do. Well, a little birdie told me on the street that he actually likes chocolate chip cookies a lot better. He likes my sugar cookies. <laughs> Trust me, he likes no. chocolate chip cookies I'm better. I'm pretty sure I know my uh, I dropped the sure kids off at the oh, pool no, I'm and I'm bad. feeling good. Oh, <laughs> wonderful. Time to test Rice Krispie treats. You're in for a treat with this one. Why does it look so square? I am very specific on how I do my lines. It's part of the creation. How did you get it so like perfect though? Well, try it first before you judge it. And by try it, I mean you're gonna love it. Mine's obviously the best here. I can't even break it. It's like. Oh, I really packed in those marshmallows. Take a bite, Marge. My pleasure. I know you'll make the right decision. Mm. Yo. <laughs> wow, Gertrude. How how did you make that so good? What can I say, Marge? Don't underestimate a grandma. Too perfect. Nothing's too perfect. I'm getting a three point to who you think the winner is. Oh, we can't vote for ourselves, so I'm gonna choose. Me? Thank you so much. Thank you. I've been working on this recipe. I'm just so happy that I got it so perfect. Let's move on to round two. Who all? Ah. Has she given the cookies to? Uh, only her boyfriend. I actually tasted them They're pretty good. Wait, she wasted them on you? Get back to the question. Uh, Did you hide the black reactivator in Big Bear? Yes. Do you know if it's still there? No, no, no. The Game Master spy stole it, but we have plans to steal it back. Who's we? Me and Amanda. And her boss. I mean, yeah. Round number two is chocolate covered strawberry. And remember, whoever wins gets to choose one cookbook of the losers to take home. <laughs> and it better not be yours, Gertrude. If I win, I'm asking you for your cookbook because those Rice Krispies were phenomenal. I am a pro at this. You dip it in, you rip the top off, and then you can put the chocolate in the inside. Oh, I don't think that's how you do it. Well, that's how I do it. I did win the last round, didn't I? Hmm. Remember, we're gonna get to taste test each of them and pick who the winner is. As long as us grandmas stick together, we'll know who the winner should not be. Yes, oh, we will, Gertrude. <laughs> we don't do electronics here. Oh, who are you on the phone with there? Oh, just kids these days. You know, phones are where we keep all of our private information and talk to all of our friends. Like, what kind of private information do you I, keep on there? I don't know much about phones. You know? I don't oh. keep private information. Everyone knows my dietary room. Restrictions, oh, if you know yeah. what I mean. <laughs> I forgot one very important thing. What? I just like to add a little extra something. Are those the marshmallows from earlier? Hey, I saved some, you know, you they came in handy. Well, that does look delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Not that good. Did you know about Project ZZ and Birth to Death of Hunger Games? Yes. Did you make the program? No, 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 no. Do you know who did? Hey! Uh, uh, ask you a question! Uh, you know what? We're going down. Okay, 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 okay. It's a hacker named Lucifer. But that's all I know. Please, please let me go. It is now time 
to taste what we have cooked. If we're really baking here, I think we should all close our eyes. I'll go first. Yeah, get him, Gertrude. First person, where is it? I'm trying to taste the strawberry. Right, right in front of you. Oh. Mmm, pretty good. Next. A little creamier. Are you gonna choose strawberry number one or two as the winner? Definitely one. <laughs> Looks like Amanda got a point. One for Amanda, zero for Marge. So far, your turn to taste, young lady. Close them eyes. Okay, take a big bite. Tastes like slow. You ready for a delicacy that all the grandkids love? Take a bite. And what do you think? Both are really bad. I'm gonna say two. What? No, it's pretty good. Oh, Gertrude's oh. stomach didn't really like that one. Uh, you know, I really have to go to the bathroom. Oh, else. you have oh. to go? Yeah, okay, I have well. to go. Make it quick. Okay. I might have to go too. These prunes are really getting to me. This is horrible. I know, my bowels don't work like they used to. No, not that, not only if she wins. We're gonna have to give her $10,000 and then we're gonna have to give away my diary. Don't get your granny panties in a bustle. I can win this challenge, okay? She's not here, you don't have to talk like that. Be nice. Oh, are you two ladies okay? Oh yeah, besides the prunes. Well, it looks like it's Marge's turn to try your two strawberries and find out who's gonna win this round. Yep. I'm ready for my strawberry. I wonder what you're gonna think about the first one. Okay, it could be a lot better. Let's see. I wonder if you had a sign. You might like number two a lot better. Wow, I don't know which one to pick. I wonder if you are listening to what I'm saying right now. But I'm gonna have to go with number two. Yes. No. Yes. Two votes for me. That was hard. You have a lot of energy. Well, isn't this great? Now Amanda's won one round and Gertrude won one. So there was actually a chance she could win this. Yay. Lucifer, yes. you can go, but remember, the police are always watching. Okay, okay. Hey, I think your hospital's back over this way. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I don't think he really has patience, but I got some good information. Lucifer, make sure that you guys comment that down below so I don't forget it. I usually forget everything. This is the final round of the Me versus Grandma cooking challenge. We're gonna be baking a cake, but blindfolded. I dropped my glasses one second. Oh, Marge, you're always dropping things. We need to get that cookbook from Amanda, and they cannot read page 46 of my diary, so I am taking matters into my own hands. Hurry up, oh. you're taking so long. I'm right here. Cake decorating starts now. Just cake it, that sounds like sprinkles to me. And I wonder who's gonna win this round and win the $10,000 and someone's cookbook. I should just go viral on TikTok. TikTok is super popular now. You know what else is? Sharing codes for phones so you can share it with your friend. I don't think that's a thing, Gertrude. You just might be mad, Amanda, because you got the ugliest color on the cake and some of us got a good color cake and uh, you got the ugliest one. <laughs> that's not very nice, Gertrude. Oh, well, life's not nice, Amanda. You'll find that out later. Some people pretend to be nice, but they're not nice. I'd rather be a mean person up front okay. than behind someone's back keeping secrets, you know? Yeah, I agree with you. Funny how that works out. Time's up, blindfolds off. Ew! Amanda, why would you put dead bugs on your cake? That is you gross. Do that, Marge? Why would Marge have some dead bugs well, on her? I'm her? sorry. I heard somebody invading my space bubble. So. Okay, well, we're blindfolded. How are we supposed to know what our space is? Yeah. I can hear like sprinkles from somewhere. Mm. That sounds like something these kids say these days. Sucks. I guess we just try the cake. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be eating bugs today. I guess you forfeit your cake and one of us has to win. I guess I should be the winner. I don't even have to try her cake to agree with that. Oh, oh looks like I won the cooking challenge. This grandma right here. Now give me that cookbook. Oh, sure, here you go. Give me the cookbook. Yeah, hand it oh, over. Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, you are welcome. Well, pleasure doing business. Maybe one day you'll be as good as us grandmas. Now get out. Meeting you, Marge. Yes. Can, okay. Bye. <gasps> we did it. We did it. Hey, Master Spice, we just got her cookbook. Now we can find the recipe for the cookies. Tell me if you see something. These are all just lame recipes. I don't see a secret recipe for any cookies anywhere. She definitely kept the recipe in the book. Matt said that. Yeah, where else would it have gone? I mean, her cookbook has been here the whole time. <gasps> I don't know, but this is so frustrating. What's that? It's a bunch of numbers. What do the numbers mean? I don't know what they mean, Marge. Game 
Mr. Spice, there are a ton of numbers. I think it's a code, but we need your help figuring out what the code is. I just wish we got more information from Amanda. Actually, what? we got her phone! <laughs> oh! Okay, Mr. Spice, comment down below if you want us to go through this sus girl's phone. And Clayton! This video right here. It's gonna be a real good time with Game Master Spies. Enough with the voice. Sorry.